I'm Anshul Agarwal. I am a third year UCLA student, currently single, looking to embarrass myself. What do you look for in a woman? Ooh, sense of adventure, um, willingness to learn, and yeah, just someone to have a lot of fun with and be around. Hey, I am Bhavi Nandu, a sophomore at USC, and I'm a little nervous, but very excited to go on a blind date and play a game of Candid Confessions. Hello. Hey. Nice to meet you. You too. Unsure. Bobby. Bobby. Yeah. Thanks for That's a great name. Oh, nice thank you. you. Cool. <sighs> Sorry, Ben, you excited? Ready I to do this am thing? very, very nervous. I'm not going to lie. You know what? Same. Like, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know. I am sweating. I am that nervous. Wait, where are you from, though? I'm from uh, the Bay Area, uh, San Jose. Uh, yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. this small yeah. place called Saratoga. Yeah, yeah. okay. You? I'm from Mumbai. Mumbai. Oh, uh -huh. no way. Yeah, so yeah. it's really hot there. So yeah. I'm really not used to this weather. Yeah. Uh, I feel like a little bitch when I say that. It's cold. <laughs> oh, am I allowed yeah. to say bitch? Oh, <laughs> okay. Am I allowed to curse? Because yeah. I curse a lot. Yeah. Okay. All right. Should we start? Cool. Okay, go All first. Right. Ladies first. Oh, yeah. okay. Never have I ever been on a blind date. Oh. All right. One, two, three, go. All right. Oh, nice. Yeah. Before. You've never been on a blind date? Never. Before? Actually, I've never really, really been on a date before. Oh, really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. I don't, I didn't, like, all throughout my life, I just it's not for me. I'm just like, mm -hmm. not my priority in life. I don't know. I'm always the type of guy that just goes, With whatever we're flow. doing, let's just do it. That's like, cool. Even today, like, mm -hmm. yeah, it, no. let's do it. Yeah. yeah. Never have I ever been dumped. Oh, easy one. Oh. Yeah. You've never been dumped before. Nope. I always 0%. do the dumping. All right, I'm before just gonna, I, no. I'm gonna quickly just. <laughs> 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 no, I, I mean before I sense anything. I don't know why it's a bad thing, no. but um, I like if I sense something is wrong, I just end it. Then end it immediately. Yeah. Never have I ever liked someone just for their looks. Oh God. Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, people are attractive. I, it's like, yeah, it's not, like, a, yeah. it's not my fault. It's not anybody's fault, yeah. right? I was super into this girl in high school. And, you know, she was, objectively, she was very attractive. I found her, like, super attractive. I was like, oh, yes, like, she's the one. Um, and because of that, I let a lot of other things slide with how, like, she treated me or, like, how, like, mm. I, like, allowed myself to be treated more than anything. Mm. Ever since then, I'm like, oh, like, Take care of yourself. Don't let yourself be treated like the mm -hmm. way that you don't want to. It doesn't matter who the person is. Yeah. But, like, oh, you yeah. gotta be you, you know? Yeah, yeah, 100%. Never have I ever judged the culture that I'm from. Oh boy. This, oh. Is a, this is a fierce. When I was here, especially in middle school and high school, I wanted to be white so bad. I wanted, not mm -hmm. necessarily white, but I wanted to be American. Oh, like, I 100% you know, like, yeah. get that. Yeah. Yep. It's like, oh yeah, like talk a different way. Like, Kind of over it. I was like, no, yeah. it's like like all the classic, like, oh, the food smells, you know, yeah. everything's smelly. Like, yeah. you know, Indians are so annoying. Like, whenever you go in, like, lines in places, mm -hmm. like, they're so loud. And it's like, uh -huh. now that I've grown up and I'm sitting here and I'm like, you know, those are things I love about my culture. Yep. I love about the people that I talk to. You mm -hmm. know, it's like, when you're in a room with another Indian, it's just a much more comfortable vibe. Because understanding that common mm -hmm. culture, like, really, like, mm -hmm. it's so much easier to talk. Yeah. So I definitely yeah. have judged it, but I don't judge it anymore. Too yeah. Much, you know? Yeah. Yes or no, pineapple is good on pizza. Yo, like, oh. no, like, wait, are you serious? No, they do not go what? on pizza. I know. That is okay. so gross. Literally, it's like the perfect mix of like salty and sweet. No, and, like, it's not. Like, uh, dude, it's amazing. Don't even talk and about you have, it. Like, like, the, the bread juice becomes, is like falling into like, exactly. the cheese. Exactly. Ah, ew. That's the I point. Wanna... All right, your turn. <sighs> okay. Never have I ever done something that could have gotten me arrested. Man, my parents are gonna watch this. this it's <laughs> okay. Mm. All right. Um, all right. Should we count I, down? No. I no? Have to, wait. Give me two seconds. Right. I need to think. I'm, I was such a nice girl, like all my life. Just like pure perfect angel. Just like, yes. Oh, yeah, Ooh, yes. Okay. Okay. So I'm, I'm thinking I mean, that's a green light. Yeah. 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 It was like one of the one of those like weekend nights where like everybody goes to party and blah blah blah. And then one of my friends had a little too much to drink, and then I had to take her home, and this another guy walks up to her and like starts grabbing her and it's like, Ooh. oh, hey, not this and that. And I'm like, wait, ho hold on, like, yeah. uh, don't even touch her. And they're like, no, I know her. And then he just pushed me, and I got really mad, so I punched Ooh. him really Ooh. hard. And he was like, yo, and I'm like, 
I remind yeah. me not to piss you off. Like. Yeah, uh, yeah, no, no, you're fine. Yeah. Never have I ever hidden a relationship from my parents. <sighs> Automatic, like, yeah. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Was not the move. Uh, like 100%. me neither. Brown parents. My, yeah. My mom knows. My dad doesn't. Oh yeah? yeah. Yeah. My mom would always joke because like whenever I was like, oh, I'm going out, and she'd be like, oh, who are you going out with? And I'd list the same three people, and then she'd uh, be like, wait, but I know for a fact that I talked to like Nishant's mom, and he's yeah. not available right now. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, caught. Never have I ever done something incredibly irresponsible before. <laughs> like, you know, classic alcohol and drugs. <laughs> of course, of course. Accidentally, though. Ac accidentally? Accidentally. So you have accidentally fell on top of, like, an open Svetka bottle and just, like, drank the whole thing? Like, <laughs> no, it's just no. like, oh, I'm... No, oh, I, I, I ate things that I shouldn't be eating. Oh, okay. We were on spring break last year, and my friends had gotten, like, these, like, cookies, and they were just, like... Uh, hey, yeah. if you were gonna do it, do it with like people who you trust, or, like mm -hmm. you know, like the whole friend thing. And um, I was like, well, I will think about it. If I ever want to do it, like I will let you guys know about it. But like right now, I'm really good. And then they just snuck it in my food. Oh, and I was, oh that's kind of I was cruising. Up. I was cruising. That's... Never have I ever regretted not telling somebody something very important. <sighs> I feel like I probably have. <clears throat> I'm me too. Parents, yeah. mostly parents. Actually, yeah, that's true. Like, I feel there's like, so yeah, much that I yeah. like. There's so much that I, that they need to know, like how I feel about them, or, like how much I respect them, or like just just everything about them. They don't know anything. Like they they literally only feel like they, oh, their daughter's out there and yeah. living her life. Like I guess I could say the same in the sense like, when I was in high school, I was definitely pretty depressed and like pretty right. like wasn't in a good place, mm -hmm. but. I never told my parents right. because I felt like they would judge me or like something. Mm -hmm. And it's one of those things where it came out like my junior and senior year and I was like, and they were completely supportive. They were like, look, let's just like talk about it. Let's talk through like, let's like see what's going on. Yeah. It's one of those things where I was like, you know, I could have just talked about this with them on day one. Yeah. And like, it would have been so much easier. Better. But like, I, yeah. I like built up all this like pent up anger and uh -huh. everything, like teenage angst. Yeah. I, know. I guess like, that's something I regret. Ooh, this is the last one. Oof. Yes or no, I was initially attracted to you. Uh, I'll say green, yeah? Yeah. I think you're pretty attractive. You're pretty like, attractive too. Personality. Thank you. thank you. Yes or no, I would like to go on a second date with you. Should I count this down? Three, Three two, two, one. one. Nice, all right. So let me get your yeah, number this. real quick. The oh, <laughs> <laughs> really? Yeah, no, straight up. Straight up. Yeah. Are you a more number person? That's so weird. I was just gonna, I, I was gonna do this. Snapchat. Oh, okay. I'm Experience? down. Experience. It's not it's that like. like more, that okay, you want to stay grounded? Just stay yeah. grounded. Hey, no. Well, okay. I'm not. I'm not saying positive or negative of you. Okay. What's up, Jubilee fam? Thank you so much for watching that episode. Wasn't that amazing? Like I told you last time, we have more of amazing Canada episodes coming for you in the next couple of weeks. So, subscribe right here. We have more videos for you right there. You are beautiful, no matter what, all the time. Don't forget that. We'll see you around. <laughs>